hello guys welcome to the programming channel new everything with JK so uh, welcome to all my dear friends and the developers you you all are programmer I know who is watching these videos so oh uh, welcome in my channel so today we are going to learn how to import and export database uh, so basically we are going to uh, use mongo's uh, command for that mongo's restore mongo's dump this two basically so first of all we have uh, lots of <coughs> uh, database here and inside the database lots of collection is there you can see uh, product and users these two collections are there so what I have to do now so I'm going to open the terminal of mongodb cell so let's do it where is that in the C folder programming file going to mongodb server 4.2 bean just here only and mongo mongo.exe this is the this 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 is the file when we are going to open it it will open the terminal of mongodb so if you want to see the databases so you have to use sh audio show dbs databases show dbs is the command of show databases just press enter you can see all your databases here so basically we are going to work with test mm, because this is the test database we have so what I'm going to do now I'm going to delete it mm, before that I'm going to take a dump so first we have to take a dump uh, using mongo's dump command so for that what uh, we have to do mm, we have to open the cmd cmd don't open it just click on it don't open like that that will not work okay you have to open it like i'll show you and going and you run as administrator okay now it will give you access to do anything here so what we have to do now we have to change the path here so just copy the path of the of your bean uh, that mongo cell uh, you have uh, just opened so you have to copy this path c drive program file mongodb server and 4.2 and bean file path okay just copy it and just type cd change directory to control v and yeah your directory is now change so we can do all these things from here now so we, what I have to do now I have to dump the test file so we have as we can see we have test test database so I'm going to do one thing mm, I'll show you this is the command mongo dump just hit it and you will get all the JSON file and JSON file of your all database so let's go and see here in the bean there is a dump file created automatically by using the command mongo dump and in that file all the databases backup is present uh, let's go for it just see it yeah there is json file json file and zip json file yeah these are the files you can restore your collection from these files so suppose that in your company they are providing you json and json files and you have to uh, import them in your database how you will do it so this video is basically for this this okay we have this kind of data like json and json files so we have to import not import export it sorry import it in our database so just do one thing i'm not going to do anything just i don't need all the collection dump i'm going to delete this from here only let's see it will delete or not oh no okay do this for all let's do it yeah it's deleted now so i'm going to delete the dump file as well 
ok mm, yeah it's deleted now you can see there is no DOM file so what I'm going to do I want a particular database dump so for that we have command as well so where we have to yeah yeah this is the all dump file so n I have to enter a command for to uh, to make only a particular database dump so what I will do the command is I'll I'll put the I, I'll enter the command mongo dump the hyphen hyphen db means database we have database to so mongo dump the database and the database name we have test database like that and just press enter yeah let's see let's see dump file created test we have only test database dump files so yeah we have test here and I'm going to do one thing from here mm, just I'm going to show you the databases so DBs so databases oh so not from here not from here yeah from here this is the mongo's terminal uh, i'm going to it so uh, sh show dbs yeah we have db so i'm going to use the uh, use uh, test use test here okay switch to db okay and now i'm going to drop it to db dot drop database drop database is a method let's see okay yeah so just going to show sh show dbs again so yeah some issues there i think uh, let me check the issue sorry so guys i did a mistake here i just I just dropped I just used this test file that's why I can see the test file is not deleted test database so I'm going to use it again sorry use test test now db dot drop database and that parenthesis yeah dropped let's see let's see the list show dbs sorry dbs yeah we don't have that test database here you can see so let's check let's check to the database it's, uh, mm, just come and connect the new cell yeah we don't have test database now and now the collection as well so what we'll I'm going to do just uh, we have backup file now you can see let's check it yeah dump that backup file we have so suppose that your company provided that uh, collection uh, sorry d database and the backup files bashan and json format so you have the collection uh, collection of bashan and json format files so you have that one and you have to import it in your database so like we don't have any uh, test database right now so i'm going to import it for that whatever uh, json and json file you have you can just uh, create a test or whatever your database name here and put your json or json file so if you want i can show you uh, just in the dom i'm going to cut it here and not here I'm going to paste it here like that and just go back and delete this file here okay so we have dump file uh, if you don't have any dump file just create it a dump file here in this bean path and just go and you have to create what your oh sorry yeah 
you have to create a folder whatever you want I j I'll just create test and just go and just put your all uh, code here so in the in the test file suppose that your company provided this oh sorry what happened sorry 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 yeah suppose that your company provided this text angular sorry where is the file sorry I have to pause this video for a few more so I have the test file here I'm going to copy my basin file suppose that your company provided your basin file here <laughs> so I'm going to copy it and going to C drive again and program file again then MongoDB MongoDB and server and 4.2 bean inside the dump I had created a test inside the test inside this test I'm going to put my basin and JSON file here surely so here you have basin and JSON files so what we we have to do we have to just import it in our database we don't have any test database right now as you can see here where is the cell so we don't have any test database so in the second cell in the second cell where is that one yeah this one we're going to dump this basin or json files we have dump inside the dump we have basin and json file test and basin and json file so how how do we how we can do this let's see mongo restore restore hyphen hyphen db db means we are going to restore the database and the database name is test as yeah your database name is test and the path we have to provide the path so the path is just in the root folder so du mp dump is the root folder and the test we have the dump inside the dump we have test file you can see here inside the dump we have test file inside the test file or in the inside the test folder we have all the files json and version files so just hit enter let's see what happened yeah done I think so so let's check your database show DBs so uh, not here not here again not here here only show DBs yeah you have test database again we have r uh, just dumped it and then we deleted it from database by using terminal then we restore it from the JSON or JSON file so yeah this is the thing and uh, let's check here again yeah we have test database previously it was 6 and right now it is 7 let's see the collection we have yeah product and zip yeah guys so this is all about mongo restore and mongo dump command so mongodb provide this restore and dump things uh, commands to do your uh, basically this is one line operation you can do it very easily to import and export your data so yeah this is the complete video guys I hope you have learned a lot from this and yeah thank you for your support guys uh, good luck for the all web developers or programmers here so thank you guys I'm going to end this video I'm going to um, and I'll come with another video as soon as possible so this is the thing we should know about MongoDB how to store and uh, dump your pr uh, database so thank you guys I hope you have learned from this video and thank you for your time thank you sir